Okay, so Flight Reacts released his top 100 NBA players of all time list. Um, I was actually just going to react to it, but since I'm anticipating it to be pretty bad, uh, I made myself a challenge. So every time Flight makes an outrageous pick, like he can't just be bad. Like I know he's going to have Curry as the GOAT. That's not bad. Like it's bad, but it's not terrible. If he has like Jonathan Kamiga in here or something outrageous, I'm gonna spin this wheel. It's a bean boozled wheel. And focus. It's not gonna focus. But it's a bean boozled wheel. So every time he has a terrible tick, I'm gonna eat a bean boozled bean. I don't even know if I have enough beans in here for this video. But, um, yeah, hopefully I won't be uh, dead by the end of this. Let's just do this then. What it do, Flight Crew? I'm scared. FTC. I'm terrified. Flight Team Stand up! You know it's February, because FTC is legendary. We got the official top 100 NBA players of all time Flight Reacts Edition list. Starting out at 100, Pistol Pete Maravich. Bro, if you're a point you don't guard, know who that you is, just like, have any type of passion for like the guard game, bro, you have to put Pistol Pete up on this list. Amari Stoudemire at number 99. Okay, we're just like running through these without very no explanation for any of these, by the way. It's just, uh, it's a name, so I got to put him on there. Right. Their appreciative player, Tim Hardaway Sr. This dude was like the very few point guards. I think I'm good with the beam boozled for, for the first today. You have Rip couple Hamilton. Here. Next up, Latrell Sprewell. Bro, Latrell Sprewell, look up his name. Not eating a bean boozled for that. But. Damn stats, bro. This man was a dog back in the day. Next up, you have Mitch Richmond. Scotty 561. Top 100 NBA players of all time, Scotty Barnes. Yep, I gotta get a bean boozled for that. Toasted marshmallow or stink bug? Great. Just fantastic. I wanna kill myself. I'm terrified. I really, oh my god. <laughs> nah, not doing that. <laughs> not doing that. Terrible idea. Terrible idea. Can't do it. I can't do it. I'm sorry. Forget that. Forget that. I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm gonna die. Flight's gonna kill me. I can't do that. Can't do it. No. No. Not happening. That's absolutely impossible. I just brushed my teeth and I can still taste it. I'm just gonna have to watch it. I ain't doing that. You could kill me. I don't care. I'm not doing it. One barn, Bill Watson. That's Chris awful, Bosch. though. By the way, you have Josh Smith. And you can't just fast, breeze by these the people. Back in the day. Next up, you have Mitch Richmond. Scotty five six one barn, Bill Watson. You have Chris Bosh. You have Josh Smith, aka Jay Smooth. Ben Wallace. Next up, you have John Wall. You have John Wall. What has Tatum done? Uh. You have Jason Tatum. You got Robert Parrish. James Worthy's coming in next on this list. You have Dominique Wilkins, the human highlight reel. You got George Iceman Gervin. You got Chase. There's no, there's no explanation. You're just naming people. So I can't even be like, oh, that's terrible. Because you're not explaining why. All right. Ben no, King. just going to watch Bob it. Cousy. Next up. Mobile games are going I'm getting big. hit with ads right now, really. Come on. You got Clyde the Glide Drexler. Next up, you have Dr. J. Next up, you got Moses Malone. You have Patrick Chewing. Carl Malone. Next up, you have Dan He had Carl Malone at 77. I know nobody likes Carl Malone because he uh touches children. 77 uh, Moses is a little Malone. You have Crazy. Patrick Chewing, Pearl Malone. Next up, you have David Robinson. We have Jermaine O. Jermaine O'Neal over. All right, Jermaine O'Neal over Carl Malone. That's valid. Next up, you have Starberry. A Stefan Marbury. Okay. Steph Marbury. You have Jerry West. You have Penny Hardaway. You have Yao. Yao Ming. All right, we're trolling. We're trolling. Elvin That's cool. Hayes. Bernard King. Next up, you have Draymond Green. 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 You have Draymond Green over Karl Malone all time is a disgusting. <sighs> I I can't even. Cal Gasol and beat up Joel. Five no. No. 
Yo, <laughs> okay. Odds, odds on seeing Tyrese Halliburton on this list. I'm thinking they're high, man. If Jordan Poole's on this list, I take everything back that I said. This is a tough, this is a terrific list. If I see Jordan Poole here, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Box up to Aaron Gilbert Arenas, man. You have Scotty Pippen. You have Reggie Miller. You have Chauncey, Mister Big Shot Billups. You have Ray Allen. You that have feels Gary low. Payton. You have Paul the Truth Pierce. And next up, that's a who is also part. Kevin Garnett at 57 is absolutely I don't even I don't even know cuz I don't even know what to expect. I shouldn't have had expected anything. This is a troll list. I know it is. Three, Kevin Garnett. But also I feel like he believes everything that he says. 54? No. Barkley. You have fear to beer, James Harden. You have CP3. Dog, you have to put Cut. All right. I have to stop. We're only two minutes in. This is gonna get way worse. This is gonna get just a slight technical difficulty on my camera. And then the only part, of course, I had to be on one of my favorite players of all time. Tracy McGrady is up next on the rankings. You have Sean Kemp. You have Steve Nash. Next up, a lot of people are gonna be scratching their head at this one. But if you have some real NBA knowledge, you don't have to put them in this list because I really feel like this player is this? Is seriously dominated on the next level. Unfortunately, if he did not pass away, you know what I'm saying, before he even got... Is this nigga serious? Rest in peace, obviously. But, this is the top 100 ranked NBA players of all time. Let me, let me step on the NBA court and you have to put Lynn Bias. Next up. Lynn Bias. I've heard that name before. I don't want to feel like I'm, I'm uneducated because I don't know who that is, but let's, let's, let's take a look here. Lynn, Lynn Bias. Is that his name? Lynn Bias. Lynn Bias. Len Bias stats. Oh, he wasn't. He wasn't bad. Rest in. I want to say, rest in peace. Obviously, but flight having him over Carl Malone. Yo, the people that you have. All right, I'm not even gonna comment. I'm not even gonna comment. You have been That's a crazy pick. That's a crazy pick. New ball. Next up, you have Spud Webb. The shortest NBA player to Spud win. Spud Webb. I think if it's not him. Over Carl Malone. He was the first. And Harden. And Draymond Green. Here, and Ray also, Allen. Muggsy Bucks. All right. And I'm still going to die on this soap, by the way. I still telling you right now. I would be. I could beat Muggsy Bogues right now in a 1v1. I could beat him. Not only, not just score on him. I could beat him. I don't care. Everything like that. Muggsy Bogues, come on, man. The Muggsy Bogues is not a top four, to 45 foot. player of you know all time. Saying, like, dog, that's no way. Bro. No way. Dame Dollar. You <laughs> have Ben Sanity. Next up, you have Russell Westbrook. You have Devin Booker. Zion Williamson. Monte Zion. Monte Ellis. A top 35 player of all time. He's not even top... He's probably not even top 35 point guard of all time, let alone 35 player. Whatever. Mississippi Bullet, Monte Ellis, man. Next up, you have Anthony Davis. SG. SGA. Of course. Of course. Has to be in there. Has to be in there. Hey, here. you got Judge. How are we flying through this list when there's a 12 minute vi- God, Marie. You gotta put Elton Brand, bro. Next up. Elton Brand. Okay. You have Dwayne Wade. Got play time. The amount of oh my god, thank God, because the amount the amount of uh bean boozled that I would have been eaten by, I would have had to eat one like freaking every pick, dude. Darren Williams, Tim Duncan. My bad, guys. Same glitchy thing happened with camera, but coming to next, Oscar Robertson, Mr. Triple Double Season. Next up, Derrick Rose is an absolute legend. Next Derrick up, Derrick Rose. Johnson. Stop camera glitch again, but you got Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Now, how many times is your camera gonna glitch? Flight sounds like you need to go to Best Buy. Come on, buddy.
Next up, you got Bill Russell. You gotta put John Havlicek in there. Bob Petit. You got Nate Tiny Archibald. You gotta put John Stockton in there. You no, you don't have to put John Stockton in there. Larry Bird. Walt Frazier up in this thing, man. Next up, Carmelo Anthony. You got Paul George. Jack A. Has Carmelo Anthony won anything? And I mean, like, no championships. I'm pretty sure. 99% sure. No MVPs. 99% sure. I th he didn't win rookie of the year because that was LeBron. So he has he has like no winning accolades, but he's top 15 all time, right? Next up, you got Kevin Durant. I'm oh, oh my God, we're just gonna fly by like he didn't just say Luka Doncic is the top 10 player of all time, which he is. But that's another discussion for another day. You got Kevin. That's 11. We have a ton of books. Luca, Shaq okay. Here, man. Be honest, Shaq at eight. Shaq into the top three NBA players of history. If he was Why didn't you? Next up. If he was what? Shaq into the top three NBA players of history. If he was able to shoot. Next up. If he was able to shoot. Okay. That's Versus. terrible, man. My favorite motherfucking NBA player of all time. The reason why I picked up the basketball. You put no thought into this list at all. It's bigger than basketball at this point, especially when it comes to Iverson. Next to the point of what I was talking to you guys. All right, here we go. Now we're getting into the glaze. What these lists are going to come down to. Bro, the influence, bro. Iverson is the reason why today your favorite NBA players are, are that was able a to crazy walk around spit. the NBA having tattoos, having braids, having locks. Having uh, so this is like how we drag out the video. We just yap. Culture into right. The NBA. Right, Wet right. First of all, first of all, the kid hasn't played a full NBA season yet. He might not even win Rookie of the Year because he's not the best rookie. It's him or Chet. Second of all, the one year he has played so far, I don't even think his team has 10 wins yet. And there's about 20 games left in this season. They're the worst team in the West. Like, third worst team in the NBA. And his name's not Wet Bananas. It's Wembanyama. You don't even know how to say his name, but he's top six of all time. Got to put Wimby in to this top list. Why do you got it's to? It's all said and done. I'm putting the bet. I'm putting everything on the money line, on the parlay. So, of any NBA player in history, if you had the sixth pick to start your franchise, of any any player in the NBA, you'd pick to win Banyama. It's all said and as I'm in the midst of the And you're, you're hitting and me with the ads after that one. Grammarie has again been a Yeah, you're, you're awful, bro. Done. Wimby will legitimately be a top three NBA player. No, he won't. He would even be five times better than what he is now if it wasn't for his hating ass teammates. Everybody on that sperm team. That is true. The go. sperms. You clearly hate okay. on him. The um, San Antonio you know, sperms. Saying, Popovich, you're getting discredited as a coach as well from the way you're limiting his minutes and you're not calling out the players passing him the ball the way they should be and stuff like that. Wemby is a legitimately top seven NBA player even this early on in his career. I don't mm. want to hear He's this not. dude is a seven foot ten and a half monster. He isn't even literally like nowhere near his body build prime. And what I mean by that, I always spoke in pre All right, about we're glazing, about we're glazing, we're glazing. Can we move on? Rank for the NBA players of all time. I better not see LeBron here. LeBron! Yeah, you're glazing, buddy. You're glazing. So you have the goat, the actual goat, just borderline top five. And then he's going to glaze him. As if, okay, who's better? We haven't seen Jordan or Curry yet. I'm still thinking about the other two people. Kobe. You have LeBron going into the top five. I mean, do I need to explain anything more? Yes, you have LeBron's to explain why he's so low. He's studied. He's still playing right now as we speak. And to be honest with you, he even has a lot more room when it's all said and done whenever he decides to retire. Um, to even get up further on this list, but I feel like it's fair from the other players I'm about to mention after, after he him retires and why he's a fifth player of all time. But he has enough room to crawl up more into the list crawl and everything up. like that because coming in after LeBron, Kobe. Who is the Brian other Williams. person, bro? Come Unless on, I'm Kobe tripping. Bryant, man, do I need to even explain? R.I.P. Kobe, his daughter, and those rest of those passengers, man. I might be Kobe tripping. is probably the most dominant shooting guard um, of all time. Um, from the post game 
to his three uh, Michael pointers, Jordan to his flexibility, existed, but... to his mama mentality. Uh, the Kobe and Shaq era, that was just absolutely amazing to witness and stuff like that. To see the controversy that he dealt with and still went in every single night in the NBA putting up absolutely crazy numbers and stuff like that uh, to the 81 point game flight is the only person on the internet that gets by with making a list like this if anybody else made a list like this they would they would be forced into retirement i can't wait to read the comments after this oh my and god he had and everything the second most points in nba history i mean you have to put kobe in the top five Anybody that doesn't have Kobe in a top five NBA list, discredit the list. You just don't turn have off the to. video. Don't even waste your breath. Don't yeah, discredit their list. Not, not yours. Not yours. not yours. Don't discredit your list. Discredit other people's. Right. Michael. Who is number Jordan. two then? Michael Jordan. I have to be tripping. Michael Jordan. No, did he, he say Kareem already? He's not going to have Kareem as a top one. two player no, of all time. Michael Jordan. He doesn't Michael know who Kareem is. Top two player of all time. Where you decide to put him is up to you. Because coming in next, Wilt the St You've never watched the game of Wilt Chamberlain, just like everybody else. So, actually, let me hear this. It better not be because he scored 100 points. Wilt Chamberlain. If we get any explain explanation. Why. Now, okay, does we Wilt do. Chamberlain have the influence of Michael Jordan? Hell no. But what Wilt Chamberlain does have, we have these dweebs on here, like, going up and firing up a video talking about, <laughs> um, well, there's no way. Will Chamberlain's 100 point game was real because um, uh, they just didn't have footage. Shit. Yo, you dumbass. Do your fucking research, my nigga. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are the dumbasses? Not Flight. Flight did his research. There's no way Flight did research it's at really all, by the way, but he did. Trust. Audio on the radio of people live commentating the game. Because of... that can't be edited. That can't be edited. That cannot be edited. We don't have any. We don't have any technology in 2024, 2023, 2020. Whenever this audio that you said was hurt was uh, surfaced, we had no technology at that point that could make fake audio. I don't believe he scored 100 points, but I'm just saying that's not a valid reason to have him as the second best player of all time. I will have, and not the fact of that. This game was played in the 1960s, pre like segregation and all that stuff, bro. That was a pre segregation period to be playing in, dog. Like, put two and two together, bro. Do you really think they're gonna make up and push the agenda that Wilt Chamberlain, who was an African American, dropping a hundred points? Do you really think during that time period they're gonna push that, bro? Like, think for a second. Not even that. Okay. Flight saw that take on, on Twitter, side. bro. Go look up Wilt Chamberlain's stats. This nigga averaged 50 points. He averaged 50 points. Because he was 8 feet tall and everybody else was a 5 foot 4 white plumber. In an NBA season, it was the 1960. Alright, I don't feel like listening to Flight Glaze. Wilt Chamberlain for the next minute. Holy. I will argue this to the end of it, bro. The last official NBA player in this race. Curry's your goat, buddy. We get it. To finish off at being the number one player. Of all time, and right now. Can we get a drum roll, please? The number one NBA player of all time, and right now, will be Staff Chef Legate. Oh, now I'm in the way. Now I'm in the way. Right. I guess just put me up here. I mean, now hey, I'm in man. the way. Come on, man. This guy is the number one shooter of all time. His longevity also needs to be studied. He's like 35, still dropping 60 points, still outdoing all your favorite NBA players. Now, also to the side effect, Curry has crazy amounts of influence, bro. And to the reason why all these NBA teams, all right, these new right, up and coming right. hoopers, all these high school, all these JUCO, oh, I all can these go college back. I can go back now. I can go back. I can go back. He's ready. Teams are averaging 30 plus threes a game now. Is because of Steph Chef. Look at Wardell Curry, man. Number one NBA player of right now and all time. There you have it. The official top 100 NBA player list is officially wrapped up. Okay, the official top 100 NBA players list of all time. Not flights official. The This is the list. So if you ever want to move like Nikola Jokic up to a top 7 NBA player, you got to think about who you're kicking out. Curry, LeBron, Wilt, 
Victor Wembanyama, not happening because flight has to approve it first. Um, that was awful. Thank God I didn't do the bean boozled because I would have died. Um, flight reacts and his, his name is 100 basketball players in no particular order. <laughs> pretty much, pretty much. That's what it felt like. Just name 100 players, flight. Go ahead. There it is. The official top 100 NBA players of all time list revealed by Flight Reacts. Um, terrible.